you do me. How dare you point that thing at me? Stop with the emotion. You don't love me. You love what I represent. You love being the... Do you even have a penis? Or are you one of those... It was from Africa, born without genitals. Trying to help you. Yeah. Well, nothing says I love you like smashing my fucking TV. Nothing at all. I'm sorry. I just wish we could do things together. Yeah, what things? I don't know. Uh, go for walks. Play ball. You know I have bad glands. Yeah. Uh, bike ride then. Bike ride. You want to go on a fucking bike ride? Fine, fine, let's go on a fucking bike ride. Uh, fuck me. We'll take a bike ride along the Spoochy Beach, and I'll show you just what you want to see. This day was going so well until you showed up, you know that? Ugh! Well, you're lucky to even be allowed out of the house after that boat stunt. What's the big deal? If anything goes wrong, you can just fake your death and start all over. How Jimmy. am I meant to develop my own moral sensibilities when yours are so unbelievably fuck-faced? If I'm hanging with you, I'm listening to my music. Oh, hell yeah. Don't push me. Seriously, some guys borrow your phone. Borrow? You were hiding in the head crying kidnapped. They just took receipt of your property with payment pending. If it was anything other than what you told me, then that's on you. All right, they fucking stole it. And who knows what they would have done if they found me, but I didn't expect or want them to get killed. You think I'm gonna let some guys right off with my son? Look, I knew you were a bad guy, but- Oh, a bad guy. A crook, a killer, a thief, a liar. I guess I've been all those things one time or another, right? It's just what? <sighs> I always thought I was the good guy. God help the morally bankrupt planet your generation have left us. If you're the good guy. Yeah. Anyway, I always knew you were the kind of person who didn't let other people get in the way, but I hadn't, like, seen that happen before. Yeah, well, that's me, Jim. And I've been trying my best to get things under control for the last ten years. But that was an extreme fucking situation, and I had to act. A normal person wouldn't have done that. Yeah, well... I had to, to protect you. Yeah, keep telling yourself that when you see their faces every time you close your eyes. Here we are, the bike rental place. Please don't shoot the bike rental guy out of, like, force of habit. Hey, you! Yep. Two bikes. Take your pick. Yo, thanks. If I make it to the end of the pier first, you're gonna buy me a big-ass new flat screen. Into the pier? All right. But if I beat you, you're gonna behave like a human being. Hey, Pop, if you're such a health nut, you should do a triathlon or some other midlife crisis nonsense. The boardwalk ain't big enough for the both of us. I mean, like, literally, it isn't. We're both kind of big.
You're buying your own TV. You know, this is real nice, Dad. Bonding, good times. Yeah, yeah, I'm giving it my best shot. Come on, we're having fun, right? You wouldn't know fun if it sat on your face. Ah, come on. I mean, why do I have to hold your hand through this whole midlife crisis bullshit? And why don't you stick your nose up Tracy's butt sometime? Because Tracy doesn't buy cars she can't afford, so that thugs break in our house. Tracy doesn't get kidnapped or destroy my yacht. Well, that's just because she's too busy getting fucked by dudes to get on TV. You don't talk about your sister that way. Well, I'm sorry, but it's true. I mean, according to her Life Invader page, she's hanging out with producers and porno guys this afternoon. What are you talking about? Actually, it's all happening right out there. What? That boat that makes yours look like a refugee raft? You know the kind of boat, the one that makes a young, impressionable girl drop her pants and spread her legs. This is the reason you brought me here, isn't it? You fuck! Ah! Dad, wait! Whoa! Hey! Take me out of here. Dad, you're embarrassing me. These are my friends. Yeah, you're embarrassing her, dude. They're shooting porno here. They shoot porno all over town. Mom rented our house to them last summer. Was what? Your house? Yeah. Man, you gotta kill her pad, Mr. <laughs> Isn't it yeah. awesome? Let's go. <laughs> Those are all the <laughs> You think I do it? Hey! No! Hey! Hey, it's cool, man. Hey. What are you doing? Hey! Ah, hey. Fuck, man! Come on! Like What's the problem? You're such a jerk! Come on! Dad, you dumbass! Guys are serious! Yeah, well, so am I! Talk to the scene of my fucking boat! Oh, motherfuckers! Get on! Now! I'm about to skin you alive! God damn it! Go! Shit! They're coming after us! Go into that outlet! If you say so, Trey! Look, they're shooting at 
them down here. Who the fuck are these people? Oh, you know, TV people, celebs, serious drug dealers. Well, since when the TV people and drug dealers start hanging out? Come on, Dad, it's Los Santos. Get away from them. Back up, you prick. Looks like this is the way out! How is camping us going to solve anything? Oh my god! Did you just kill him? Hey, don't worry. It's amazing what modern medicine can do. You killed them! Oh my god, this isn't happening! Take a deep breath, baby. It's okay. I'm taking you back to your brother. I'm an accessory to murder! No, you're not! You're an accessory to self-defense! Have I, like, got to be a witness because I... I, like, did some blow? You did blow? Yeah, I did some blow, and that might, like, make my testimony inadmissible! You're not admissing anything! There won't be a trial unless you're on a trial for doing blow! After you ruined my day, stole my friendship, capped them, and I'm the one on trial? They started it! And we wouldn't be in this mess if you hadn't hung out with some creepy-ass porno people and done blow! Uh, you didn't know I did blow until I told you I did blow, so this should be like an increase in trust and honesty thing. And porno dudes are like the best dudes I can be with. Porno dudes? Really? Yeah, they actually respect women and treat us right. It's Los Santos, Dad. What do you expect when he moves here? Enough! This conversation is over! Keep hiding your head in the clouds. The 50s are over. Even the 80s are over. See, that's the problem. Because they're not over in my head. There he is! Jimmy, you D-bag! You! You fucking asshole! Ah! Yeah, he, he's the fucking asshole, okay? He smashed my TV, and he took me to the beach. The beach, with my skin. So what, you send him out to spoil my day, too? I didn't know that he was gonna come get you. I just told him where you were. You know, he got that crazy look in his eyes, you know, like he gets sometimes, and he just went. I'm getting a cab. I'm coming with you. How about I just drive us home? You ruined my life.